page one, fresh out of toys, Santa makes his way back. When he hears a small noise from inside of his pack, a sound that's not unlike a baby's cry, it's enough to leave the jolly guy perplexed. And? Come on, buddy, what comes next? Page two, back from his ride, Santa gathers his elves. He gathers his elves. They quickly decide they'll raise the baby themselves. The North Pole isn't made for humans, though, and soon the phony elf begins to grow so tall. He learns he's human after all. It's the story of Buddy the Elf. It's the story of Buddy the Elf. It's the story of... And the books will fly right off the shelf. It's the story of Buddy the Elf. And maybe Buddy helps his dad in a setting much like this. And maybe his father learns a son is something he can't dismiss. They might learn that they need each other much more than they know. Maybe the point of the story is it's never too late to grow. It's never too late to grow. That's it. That's the story of Buddy the Elf, which has gone on to become the best-selling children's book in the world. And it probably won't come as a surprise to you that they all lived happily ever after. Read it again. Read it again.